Hey guys, so I'm a day late, a day and an hour late. Technically I'm two days late, so since technically it's Wednesday here, but Tiana hasn't made a video yet, so I'm going to make mine, and then I'll remind her, because I've been trying really hard to remind everybody of their days of their videos, so they d don't forget, and they can make videos, but it's not really working. I'm Aaron and Lexi, <coughs> okay, um, let's see, not really anything interesting happening. Lots of work, lots of school, lots of lack of sleep. I got six hours last night. Oh my god, it was amazing. Best sleep of my life. Not really, but sleep of like the last three weeks. And, um, uh, I've decided I'm quitting e Ricky because I just can't, like, I can't handle nausea anymore. I just can't, like, it's, it's too much stress for not enough reward like it's just it's not worth it I asked one of the servers if he would still be working there if he only made nine dollars an hour which is what I make and which is not that much because it's minimum wage is 825 in DC not 725 like it is most other places um and he was like nine dollars an hour he's like the first time they yelled at me I would be out of here like because it's like there's so many other jobs out there that I could be getting. Like, I know everyone's always like, oh, they're like, the um, unemployment is so high, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, yeah, that's for like professionals. That's for people who like have degrees. For people who are willing to work as a server or as a hostess or as like some dumb desk job or something, like minimal, like minimum wage, whatnot. Like, it's pretty dang easy to get a job. I don't know. I think so, anyways. Like, when I applied to Eriki, I applied to three other places and got hired for two of them and asked to come in for an interview for one of them so it's like it's not especially when you have experience like it's not that hard and so I'm just like I'm just so sick of nausea just always ragging on me about everything and about things that I don't do and he's just he's so abrasive all of the time he's rude to the customers he's rude to me he's rude to the servers and I I just can't handle it I'm like I don't deserve this I don't care that you're my senior in rank and age it doesn't matter I don't care how old you are I don't care if you're the president of the United States you have no right to talk to me like that you just don't and I realize that it's not my fault that he's like that. He's just like that. And I don't deserve to be in that kind of environment. And it's not conducive to a healthy me. And I need to start thinking about myself more than I have been. So I'm going to quit that. There's a job fair tomorrow. So maybe I'll find like a desk job where I can try to do some of my homework while I'm working. And like getting paid and whatnot. So, because that would be nice. And yeah that's about it that's all my news I'm gonna go to bed now since it's 12.56 and I still have a poem that I have to memorize in Russian I'm gonna wake up early and do that and probably still won't be able to do it because it's a poem in Russian can't even memorize poems in English anyways that's fine I'll figure it out okay well I keep this short and sweet unlike Tiana I mean, it wasn't boring. It was just long. Okay. Anyways, love you guys. And, yeah, I think that's it. Yeah. Also, you guys should come visit me for, like, spring break or something. I don't know. Figure your shit out. I want to see you. I want you guys to see where I live in D.C. And even if you come when it's not my spring break, because you guys can go exploring D.C. and do what not because it's not like it's some boring little town or something like that like there's stuff to do while I'm in class so yeah anyways okay I'm gonna be done now but yeah love you and miss you bye